Hey guys, and welcome back to Skies of Arcadia. And I need to take my microphone off my headset because it keeps hitting my actual proper microphone, which is really annoying. There we go. Okay, so yes, yes, we got here to this new lovely Hortica land, I guess. Uh, now, where were we? That's going to lead back to where we came, if memory serves. So, let's go down here, because we've got some chests to find, so let's go do that. Also, the fast forward uh, button on my emulator seems to not be working, so ha! I might have to have a fiddle with it in a minute. So, anyway, let's go. Uh, we've got some chests and things to get from memory, yeah. I think we need to go up here. Need to have a little look around. Let's go climb up this, like a regular baboon. The baboons climb? Probably. Pretty sure they eat each other as well. And they do have fantastic coloured arseholes, which is uh, kind of bizarre. Actually, I think it's just the males that have um, colourful arseholes. I'm not really sure. Anyway, let's go. Come on, Vise. Oh, yeah, we get to go down the super fun happy slide. Now, I, it's been, uh, ooh, dear, three weeks, maybe, since I've played this. So, uh, kind of rusty on what we've done and what we haven't done. Um, yeah, but hey, I'm, I'm sure we're going to figure it out together. I know from watching the last part of the last video, I know we've got one of the chests which leaves three chests left to get. Now, there's actually a chest behind this. There's some offerings of fruit. I guess this picture of that guy, Quieter, that the Ixatakans keep talking about. Yeah, really uh, have not had any time, um, sadly. But hey, we get a sacred box. So I can mark that off on my guide. Uh, I've also scrapped using all of my paper guides. So I've printed out hundreds of pages of guides. Uh, but it's just not practical. It like I cover my entire desk with guides, and I still have guides that are on the floor for this game. So I've set my laptop up next to me uh, after trying to use my tablet for the same thing, and it's just it it's just you know it it's not Windows. So I've actually dug my. Uh, laptop out and decided to use it for the first time in a fucking hundred years. Now how do we get back from here? I'm guessing nope we can't go back up there which is curious. Do you have anything to say? Young maiden? Nope. Oh yeah because everybody hates us don't they? Get out! We don't have food for Easterners. Oh well fuck you too. Well that's fine. Didn't want to eat any of this shit anyway. Probably mouldy. I don't want fruit. I want a steak. Uh, right, so I guess we're going to continue going up. We actually need to go back to the start, ironically enough. Um, might have to make 20 minute videos as well, potentially, just due to lack of time. But we'll see. We'll see how we go. Okay. So yeah, we hang on, we came up here before, didn't we? Did we really miss that chest? Eh, probably. Come this jar is empty. Maybe they use it to carry the stuff in the big pots. Okay, well, I mean I guess there isn't much up here. That's disappointing. But it is what it is. Aha, we have an exit. Ooh. Do we not get... Do we not do all of this? I feel that we did a lot of this. Why is this not saved? Moonfish has caught, been caught. Okay. Nice. Better update that on my guide as well. Okay, cool. So we've got the moonfish. I think that's the only moonfish to get here as well, which is fine. I'm going to pause every time I update my guide. Otherwise, you'll have to watch Vase standing around getting very impatient. Kind of like Sonic. Remember Sonic? 
I remember Sonic. Ah, <laughs> but, but, dear viewer, do you remember when Sonic was good? Yeah, it was a while ago, wasn't it? Yeah. Yeah. Well, and then that leads me to believe, uh, to, to wonder, was Sonic ever really good? Was he? Yeah, he was. Yeah. He was, at one point. A couple decades ago. Well, technically we had that decent uh, Christian Whitehead one not that long ago. That was pretty good. Right, so, uh, we've got that. We've got the cham. Now, ah, yes. We need to go down here because this is very important. I said we got the cham. We actually haven't got the cham, but we're about to get a cham. Uh, this is cham number six, I believe. There we go. This is actually a very important area as well. Right, munch. So I can now mark that off my guide. Man, I really need a new laptop. Ugh. One with a 1080p screen. 720p screen, man. You really can't fit a lot of words on that. Uh, anyway, you know, first world problems and all that. So, what have we got out here? We have a field. Hmm. With some children playing. Hello. Who are you? Uh, I'm Vase. Who are you? Uh, are you just going to say who am I? Who are you? My father's not here. Yeah, there's a, probably a lot of children uh, that have experienced that. Looks like we have some sort of derelict ship here. Yeah, that's... Oof. It's been here a while, huh? To judge from your appearance, I gather you came from over the ocean way. Uh, yeah. What's it to ya? Okay, cool. Alright, well, let's have a look at this. This is cool. It's quite an impressive vessel. Uh, I mean, I guess it was in its day. Hello, you don't seem to be from this town. Who are you? We're not. Actually, uh, we had to cross the South Ocean to get here. My name's Vise. Vise, Vise, whatever. Wow, you are able to cross the South Ocean? That's impressive. My name is Hans. Good to meet you. We're Blue Rogues, under the command of Captain uh, Pentime. We had to crash here, crash land here, after a hurricane knocked us off course. Pentime. He's the Blue Rogue that takes in orphans and trains them. What a guy. I also heard that he's a brilliant engineer. Yeah, he was. Uh, I mean, Niz, the Valuans kidnapped him and are forcing him to build weapons for them. Uh-oh. We're staying here and working on the ship until he returns. Oh, uh, I hope he returns soon. Yeah. Yeah, me too. Hey, Hans, I was wondering if you could help us out with, help out some fellow Blue Rogues. We burned all of our fuel crossing the South Ocean. Do you think you could spare a few moon crystals? Oh, Ica, you sly little dog. Of course, we've got plenty to spare. Here, take these. But uh, That was easy. Um, thanks. We owe you one. You've really helped us out a lot. Uh, you're welcome. Well, uh, I need to get back to work. Good luck. Yeah, um, hey man, good luck to you too, friend. Uh, I, I think you're gonna need it. This ship has, um, seen better days, I guess. We can go inside. Wow, dude. What a wreck. All the repair methods and replacement parts are listed in amazing detail. Talk about organized. Yeah, well, I don't think these jungle savages are going to have many of these parts lying around. So, good luck with that. Yeah, parts from all kinds of different ships have been used in rebuilding this thing. It must take a lot of skill to build something with such a random selection of parts. Okay, so I guess they have access to some things. Or just a load of grumpy... Um, jungle people, I guess. And you received Sacra Crystals 25. Yeah. Uh, you know, couple. So not only has uh, we relieved them of some of their fuel, 
you know, God bless them. They've actually, uh, we've just stolen all of their healing crystals. But, you know, it's all fair game, isn't it, at the end of the day? We have a lot of discoveries to find. 25 sacred crystals. Mark that bad boy off the map. Now, there is one more um, chest to find around here. And I need to try and remember where that was. I'm sure I can figure it out. <laughs> so, we got the cham. We got three of the four chests. Do we? Right, so let's go down here. We need to find a cave. And I'm pretty sure I know where the cave is. Did we look in all of these houses? I'm pretty sure we did, right? Is this a load of grumpy, like, ah, uh, yeah, because this is the, sh the weapon shop. These guys don't like me. I have nothing to sell a person from the east. Yeah, cool. Very nice of you, dude. I'm sure your primitive weapons are of no interest to us whatsoever. Anyway, spoiler, they're, they are. They're actually quite good. Um, Now, I think we're going to want to head down here next. You might be thinking, holy shit, this place is a confusing maze. Yes. Yes, it is. You're, you're absolutely right. This place is very confusing. Um, now, I need to... Aha! I think this is what I'm looking for. Uh... So I think this is where we're going. Now, who is in here? Oh, it's the weird droopy woman. Looks like the spear and mask. I mean, yeah, we're not looking at the spear and mask. We're looking at that. Yeah, don't worry. I don't want to bother you. Don't want to get flopped on. Um. Okay, so. Keep going this way. I think we go up, up here now. There's one more chest. And it has an item in it. I can't remember what that item... Ah, yes. Here we go. See, sometimes I remember things about stuff. Hello, friend. Girl, you're from the east. Everybody hates people from the east. You best be on your way. Well, at least you weren't horrible. So, you know, there's that. Anyway, we're detecting another moonfish around there. Well, he doesn't say anything to us, which is fine. We don't mind that. We can work with that. Now, I was another moonfish. I guess I would be here. Hey, friend. Whoop. Moonfish was caught. Moonfish number 11? Question mark. Hey, dude. What's going on? I saw you come from the eastern sky. I can see many things from here. Oops. I must not talk to people from the east. You better not. You better forget what I said. Yeah, well, I'm not really going to take anybody seriously that's dancing around like a chicken. And there we go. The uh, Paranta Seed. I don't know what that does, actually. It's obviously some kind of buff. Now, Chris told me, um, get, tipped me off, to save the seeds for the final person you get, which is what we shall do. The seed of the panda tree, which blooms under the red moon, increases power by three. Yeah, so we're probably going to save that. Because Mr. Chris gives excellent advice. So, right, we've got all of these. And one second, I'm going to just check everything off my guide and make sure that we haven't missed anything. Okay, I think we're actually good. The music here is absolutely wonderful as well. It's so upbeat and happy. You know, this game has a very positive attitude to it, which is kind of interesting when you think about the time that this game came out. You know, most RPGs of the time, you know, Final Fantasy VII, um, was, yeah, that would have been a pretty recent one. And I, possibly Final Fantasy VIII was out at the time as well. And, uh, you know, Grandia 2, I believe. 
Games like that were really kind of like down and dingy. And this game's got such a positive um, attitude to it. Which is quite refreshing. Right, so we're going to save it. Anyway, also, I should also mention this dude up here. The guy that um, I believe... Is this the guy? Let's check his name. I did forget to mention this. He'll actually join us. Or well, one of these guys will. Uh, but not yet. We, 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 yeah. Later on, uh, once the story opens up a bit, we actually have to uh, create our own crew, which is actually a really cool thing. Now, a lot of the crew members are missable. But I'm pretty sure... No, he's just called the Masked Man. Well, there's someone up here anyway. It might be him. Um, yeah, he's one of the uh, one of the crew members, or at least you know, someone up here is. Do you? Yeah, they're all called Masked Men. I'm pretty sure uh, they get names once they're a little bit friendlier towards our cause. Okay, now let's go have a little chinwag with this chap. Elderly innkeeper, so you're from the east. You look tired. Would you like a room for the night? It'll be a hundred and... Yeah, yes, go on. Sure, why not? Actually, this is not the hut I thought it was. This is the inn. I thought this was the elder's place. Wait a minute, that is... Is that not the elder? Yes, that is the elder. So, you're the ones from the East who people have been talking about. I. So, you're from, you are from the East. Your people bring disaster. Leave this village immediately. Wait a minute. Why does everybody keep talking about these men from the East and this quieter stuff? I don't even know what a quieter is. Quieter is our god. Generations ago, when the giants came to destroy us, Quieter appeared and saved our village. Ancient prophecies say that Quieter's message messengers will come from the east and save us if our land is ever in danger. I understand, and since we came from the east, that is why everybody thinks Quieter sent us. But if Quieter's messages are supposed to save you, then why did you say that people from the east bring disaster? Exactly. Even now, the men from the east are destroying our land. They claim they come from a place called Valua. Ah. Yes. Them. Valua? They're here too? When the people from Valua came, everybody thought Quieter sent them. Even the king came to greet them. The people from Valua said they wanted moonstones. We took them to our sacred mountain where we keep glow rocks. So, you call them glow rocks or moonstones? So the Valuans came to steal their moonstones. Yes, Fina, keep up. And then the people from Valua attacked us with fire-breathing iron ships. They took control of sacred mountain. I remember that ship. Hmm. Everyone, even the king, fought. But many were killed and the forest was burned. The survivors were taken as slaves. Yeah, that that ain't gonna do. That's terrible. They're using your people to gather the moonstones so they can make weapons. So that's why everybody is so against the men from the east. Well, pretty obvious. Please, you need to trust us. We're different from the Valiants, the men from the east. We fight against Valua so they can't hurt people. And that is why we've come all this way. We need a very precious stone called a moon crystal. Mm. You can't expect him to trust us. You're wasting your time, boy. Please, I'm telling the truth. Please. Whoa, he looks like a shriveled beetroot or something. If you fly north from this village, you'll see a small hut in the middle of the forest. That is where our king is hiding. The kings of our land have always passed down the sacred green stone from generation to generation. This may be the stone that you seek. Your eyes, they're pure. I believe that you are here to help us. Please save our people. Uh -huh. Thank you. I will not betray you. 
And we won't. Let's go. We've got a village to save. Hmm. Let's do it. Right, so now, I'm not sure if now everybody likes us. Now words got out. Or if we actually have to complete uh, Moonstone Mountain first. I mean, I guess we can just find out by climbing up here and having a little chinwag with this person. Oi! Are we friends now? Please. Love me! Uh, this song is for Quieter. When the Valuans came, I played this song in the Welcome Festival. Now I play to ask Quieter to come and drive off the Valuans. Yes, you need no... You have no use for gods around here. We're here. Or something. The Elder said you defeated Valua. Is that true? He did. <laughs> I've always believed in Quieter. I believe someday Quieter will come and destroy the Valua for us. Valuans. Maybe you were sent here by Quieter. Do you think so? Yeah, I'm kind of getting tired of saying that name over and over again. Jesus Christ. But, you know, at least we can go back around and talk to everybody now. Because everybody's like, we're here to save them. Because, in all fairness, you know, the other Blue Road crash ship has done them no harm. You're not a bad man. The Elder said so. Ah, yeah, this, yeah, this is the guy that we can recruit. I thought it was. I am uh, Taki Tika. Taki Tika? Sounds like a curry. Uh, I was the first to see you coming. My eyes are sharper than the birds. I am proud of my eyes. Yes. If I concentrate, I can see anything, no matter how far. Shall I show you? Uh, I will... Oh, my curiosity is getting the best of me. I would rather back away very slowly, making no sudden movements, but show me. All right, here goes. <laughs> ah, a golden man to the north. I see a golden man. In the northern sky, there is a golden man. It is the truth. Go see for yourself. Uh, yeah, cool story, bro. Uh, yeah, you, you sit there and fantasize about your... I'm assuming herculean muscled oiled golden man we're uh we're, we're gonna go and save the village Ooh, strange strange people anywho let's explore let's start talking to people because you get entertaining things like that uh we're on 23 minutes man oh I'm enjoying this. Uh, okay. Anyway, let's keep going. It's such a great game. Hello. Oh, God. Floppy. My son. He was taken away by the Valuans to work on the Moonstone Mountain. Every night, I have terrible dreams of my son crying and suffering on the Moonstone Mountain. I am so sad. I am so sad. Yeah. Well. We're here to help. Honest. Even. Even people like you. Strange people. Uh, right. Who else do we have here? Uh, I guess nobody in this one. We're here to save the population. At least. We're gonna try. So let's just keep climbing this eternally long ladder. Because that's what we do around here. Damn it. Uh, right, so let's go talk to these people. Oh my god. Ooh. Don't th think there's any point in going down there and talking to them. Because they're not part of, um, this tribe. Hello. Oh, we should be able to buy stuff now. Um, is there something you'd like to buy? Oh, now you'll take my coin. Yeah, right, okay. Let's see what you've got. What have you got? Oh, actually, that was quite good. We've got 73 crystals. I did worry uh, that when we opened that chest, 25 crystals, I did wonder if we lost a lot of those. I don't think you actually can lose them, but uh, I'm not sure. Wow. Sacrum crystal. Oof, yeah, that's, that's kind of what we want to be looking at. Um, we have a lot of those. So, oof. 
Uh, right. 50% chance of reviving one ally. Yeah, so they're not great. They're really not. Imagine if a Phoenix down in Final Fantasy only worked 50% uh, of the time. But it's the best we can have at the moment. So, cures all adverse effects on one ally. I had a very interesting tip as well from uh, Chris, again, Games Librarian. Um, if I use Ika's ability, the one that resists magic, that debuffs all of our buff magic off her as well, or, or blocks all of our buff magic, uh, which I guess makes sense, that's cool. But you can still use the items to get the same effect. I didn't know this. Uh, that was like some sage level advice from our buddy, the games librarian. Uh, we're going to need to buy some of these. Oh, they are expensive, but uh, yeah, we'll get one. We'll come back. They are expensive, but obviously they are, you know, good. So we'll come back. The Valuans, they were looking for the sacred green stone. They said it shines even brighter than the moonstone. I've never seen a stone like that, but they took away everything in the sh took away everything in the shop anyway. Uh okay. Well, you seem to be selling me stuff. Alright, Chief. The elder says, I must help you. So even though I don't like it, I will sell to you. Yeah, you know, help doesn't necessarily mean sell. You could just, you know, generously donate these... Ah, uh, who am I kidding? For a long time, we did not fight wars. Weapons were only for hunting or as defense from wild animals. Yeah, I can understand that. But ever since the Valuans arrived, I've started making weapons to use against people. Good man. Let's have a look. Let's, let's, let's have a little look at what you got. Hunter's sword, plus 17. Yes. Cheers, friend. That's quite the upgrade. Yeah. Very nice. Okay. Hunter arc. Ooh. Ah. See, our high goes down by, by 40. I'm not 100% sure what that high is. So we lose a little bit of attack and we lose a little bit of uh, magic by the look of things. Golden armor. Very nice. Uh, oh, fuck. It's expensive, though. That adds quite a lot to your dodge. I think it's dodge. I need to look at what all these different things are. I know you've got attack, defense. WI, I believe, is your magic. Think or is that MA magic defense? Possibly high is hit, I think. DO is dodge and QU is I think that's speed. I'm not sure. Um, right, so we need we need that because I just I do prefer damage. So let's have that. Uh, miners overalls, Vise and Drachma. It's a lot cheaper, but that is better. Well, it's not actually decisively better. Uh, I mean, Fida can have that because that's straight up better. Right. And anything we can do to buff Fina is, you know, good, I guess. Um, I guess... Hmm. I mean, yeah, that's still better. So, sure. We'll get two units of that. One for Vase. Should have just bought two. And one for Drachma. Um, now. See, Ica. It is more defense, though. And although Ica does use magic, she uses defensive magic more than anything else. So let's get her one of those. I think the benefits outweigh the negs. 
Right, let's sell some stuff. Let's sell some of these old weapons. Just because. We want um, as much money as we can get to buy those new crystals. Because we can grind money out another time. It's not a problem. Right. Oh. I'll buy for those. Should really have been selling this stuff before, but <laughs> it just takes so long. There we go. I kind of, uh, yeah, uh, for a while at least, I was thinking about just holding on to this stuff. Uh, all of this stuff, I mean, yeah, we'll, we'll hold on to that for now. Okay, that'll do. Yeah, 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 yeah. No. There we go. Okay, now, sell me your crystals. Uh, let's get, say, 20 of these, I guess. 20 of those? Yeah. What have I done here? Yeah, we did go to buy. Okay, so let's get 19 of those. That leaves us with six grand. I mean, yeah, 20 of those. I mean, that, that, that's a lot. Okay, cool. Let's go. Uh, right. And that's quite convenient. We've got a save spot. So we're going to give it a save there, guys. And when we come back, well, uh, looks like we're going to go back to our ship. You're right, dude. You look for the sacred green stone, just like the Valuans. The Valuans demanded that I tell them where the sacred green stone was. They beat me over and over. I thought I was going to die. Yeah, it's it, it is an upbeat game, but there's yeah, there, there is some some pretty sad, pretty rough stuff that actually happens, which is kind of interesting. Anyway, I'm going to leave it there guys. Thank you very much for watching, and as always, till next time.